Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Simon, and welcome to another episode of Hunter x Hunter. Uh, last episode was a bit like watching an episode of Antiques Roadshow for anyone in the UK who's seen that. Um, <laughs> basically, just all based around auctions, finding out how much old stuff is worth, trying to make as much money as possible. It's exactly what Conan Killer were doing. Um, they were trying to find items that were imbued with Nen, and it turns out that they were pretty valuable. So, still trying to, um, you know, gain as much uh, money as possible. And, you know, Gon, of course, gave up his Hunter's License, which um, it was confusing to me. I mean, I know some of you have said that the Hunter's License is only, you know, they're basically only um, valid for the person who they're for. So, they're not really that valuable um, to anyone else, but again, it just doesn't make much sense to me. I mean, a hundred million doesn't seem a lot in the, you know, the, the bigger picture when you're looking at nine billion. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, why don't we find out what happens this episode? So, enough chat. Let's react. But the pair is not simply waiting around to be caught. Yeah. They're wearing their hair strangely. Probably, yeah. Uvo may have been a brute, but he wasn't stupid. I certainly can't disagree with you there. Yeah, but he's dead. No matter how tough his opponent was, he is he gonna try and to take them on? Really? Let's go. Come on. <laughs> They're gonna be onto them. Uvo didn't come back this Surely. Time. Has he ever been this late without letting us know before? You heard what he said, didn't you? Okay, we should decide our next move. So how should we go about capturing these two? Yeah, really, yeah. Look, they're way Kill them. our league. It's not happening. Oh, come on! We won't know until we try. And besides, why didn't you mention this before? <laughs> Stop yelling. They'll notice us. But it's the truth. I knew it as soon as I saw them. A while back. My dad killed a spider for a job. Oh. His dad managed to kill one? He doesn't complain much. But he said the job wasn't worth the price. And that is the highest compliment he gives a target. He even got all of us together and told us we should steer clear of the Phantom Troop. Mm. That was years Impressive. ago. Impressive. So I thought we might stand a chance. The people sitting at that table were both Hisokas. <laughs> yeah. I guess it's safe to say that's a lot more than we can. Hear. Ironic because okay. Hisoka is part of the so troop what at the do you moment. Think they're doing here. They're dating. It's a date, right? Wait, is it really? No, of course not. They notice that other couple behind them. I can tell they're paying close attention to yeah. the surroundings. I was gonna say they surely I noticed. Just being cautious since the mafia is after them. The boss said to find him and bring him back. Those were our only orders. There's no chance you're recruiting the chain you user. You've forgotten all about the unspoken rule, have you? Alive or dead, and by any means necessary. You're welcome to interpret the boss's orders any way you see fit. But are we going to take him dead, or try to bring him in alive? Oh, all right. Flipping a coin. But you haven't said which is which. Heads. Tails, then. So heads he lives, tails he dies. Supposedly. Huh. Yeah, she's Nostrad's daughter. Her name's Neon. Hmm. Me thinks she's gonna die. So that's what happened. Getting a new room was a smart move. The Phantom Troop is using the Hunter website. There's absolutely no doubt about it. Of course, my dear, I promise. And have I ever in my uh. life broken a promise to you? Well, yeah. More yeah. than cat. <laughs> oh, he makes up for it by buying her things. Your names are Melody and Basho, yes? yes? Yes. You two take Neon back to the mansion immediately. Be safe. I want you both wearing simple disguises. Mm. Yeah, no, Neon, Melody's definitely going to need a disguise. Your things. Okay. All right, let's get down to business. The underground auction will be resuming tonight. Oh, okay. The time and place haven't changed. 
The community must demonstrate that they will not be intimidated by anyone. So, as I was just saying, with all the Shadow Beasts destroyed, the Ten Dons will hire pros to handle the troop. Sir? So, hold on, when the Shadow Beasts supposed to be stronger the than pros? Uses murder as a tool of intimidation. Oh, he's the pro. That That's succeed. Killer was dad. Considering the nature of our opponents, it would be wise for us. Oh, it's Killer was family. <laughs> but he said he wouldn't do it again. While avoiding further losses ourselves. Oh, this is going to be so awesome. However, it's a chance for us to build our reputation. We can't allow the assassins to take all the credit. And so Kurapika, I want you to join the assassin team. Oh shit, Karapika's working with Killua's family. No problem. I'm guessing you've never tracked anyone before? Oh, uh... Nope, yeah, he tracked Hisoka. I tracked Hisoka during the exam. Yeah. <laughs> really? And he didn't notice you? No, I shadowed him pretty much the whole day. Yeah. God, that All seems right, like just yesterday. That Whoa! <laughs> what did you hit me for? Huh? Oh, no reason. No well, reason? You shouldn't have a problem then. <laughs> Just be sure to stay out of their field of vision, no matter what. I've been playing life or death games of Shadow ever since I was three. He doesn't I know that his... Sight of them. I can't. Is he going to see his dad? And then that's going to, like, shock him? Yes, most likely. Uh-oh. It's a pretty good bet, anyway. Since it's not, the chain user probably defeated Uvo alone, without ever reporting it to the mob. Yep. Doesn't make sense. Why would someone with ties to the Mafia work alone? We know. Probably a personal grudge. Probably, huh? You've been saying that a lot. Oh, shut up. Trust his instincts. Revenge without Mafia backup. I doubt that he'd be teaming up with someone else. Thus, the chain user works alone. The group following us is totally... This guy's good. Impressive how full of holes your logic is. What do we do? They might be waiting for someone else. Hold your position. <laughs> oh, I thought that was one of their phones. Pay close attention. And if they react at all, we're gonna make a run for it. And don't stop. The next time I ring, it means we bail. Got it? Yeah, I got it. It's Vix. Oh, what's up, Vix? Just wanted to see how you're doing. We were being followed for a while. They haven't made their move. I want to. I want to see that samurai sword. So this will take some time. <laughs> oh shit! Whoa! Oh crap! How did he get there already? Uh oh! Shit's about to go down. Whoa! 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 Pinball! Jesus Christ! Where did you learn to do that, Killua? Oh shit! A diversion? Got him! Oh crap! This guy's fast. It easily with his left hand. Oh, super strength! Ah, did he just rip the skin? Hello, Finks. Guess I should have known. They tailed us while we tailed them and our targets. Uh. <laughs> they tricked us. So, they are smart. You know, I've got a couple of questions for you. Oh, Do go. Do you know the chain user and think before you answer? <laughs> He's a Nen user who fights with chains. We're trying to find him. Is he the one who asked you to follow us? Was this his idea? I don't know him. Yeah, we they don't know he's... They don't know that Karapika's using chains. Who taught you to do that? It was a Shingen Ryu master. And three. Do you know a Nen user who fights with chains? Fights with chains? He'd be a conjurer or manipulator. We no, need again. to know if your master has chains hanging from his right arm, or is it you? You should come clean right now if it is. I really Why don't to be know. Him? My master is an enhancer, and he just taught me the four basic exercises, nothing more. Well, that's a pity. If you don't know, we got nothing. It's time for the last question. I'll give you two choices, but think carefully before you answer. 
Do you want to die now or later? It's up to you. You have three seconds. Huh. Does later constitute a few minutes? Oh, it's no use. Don't she caught him. Anything. Yes. Understood. On our way. Oh, oh crap. Boy. That friend of yours surrendered quietly. Oh, man. How is it they get out of this one alive? Because now they know where they're staying. I've got a feeling Hisoka's going to come to the rescue. Well, yeah. They're fucked. Um, I can only foresee... Either help from Killua's family or Hisoka being the realistic escape routes here. Um, yeah, I mean, Gon and Killua have got no idea who they're facing here. And to be fair, I was in that situation a few episodes ago. I was thinking, surely the Phantom Troop, they can't be that bad. You know, Hisoka is kind of like on a different level to anyone we've seen so far other than, you know, Killua's family. Um so I was thinking, yeah, these guys are going to be nothing. Then they beat the Shadow Beasts. Um, you know, and then we found, we found out, you know, that Hisoka was part of the Phantom Troop. Um, oh, well, we found out that first, but you get my point. Um, and then we saw just how badass Uvo was. So, I mean, Gon and Killer are in the same situation. They don't even know Corrupt because they're the one using the change. The, the change. <laughs> the chains. Um, at least I don't think they do. That seemed... I can't remember them meeting up with him since he started using them. Um, where's Leorio in all this? Is he going to send for help? <sighs> yeah, it's just it's a bad place for them to be. And I don't know how they're getting out of it. Um, oh, man, the... the Ripping the skin off Killua's legs. That was horrible. It wasn't nice. But uh, anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching and I'll see you for the next one.